What is a cryptocurrency? A cryptocurrency is a form of payment used exclusively for digital transactions. It is a digital currency secured by cryptography and based on blockchain technology. Cryptography secures cryptocurrencies and makes them difficult to counterfeit or double spend. The blockchain is basically a decentralized public ledger that records electronic information and transactions in a digital format and then distribute them across a network of computer systems. Because cryptocurrencies are built on this decentralized structure, they can exist outside the control of governments and or central authority. Unlike currencies issued in your country, which are controlled by your country's central bank, cryptocurrencies are not subject to any form of control. While you keep your money at the bank and thus have your own account, digital money is kept in a digital wallet. Each digital wallet has both a public and a private key. The public key is something like your account number that you send to someone to send you some coins. The private key is something like your signature that you use to sign the transactions. Currently, more than 15,000 different cryptocurrencies are publicly traded and the total value of all cryptocurrency is around 2.3 trillion US dollars. This number fluctuates greatly due to the volatility of the crypto market. The most popular digital currency with the highest market capitalization is, you guessed it, Bitcoin. It was introduced in 2009 by someone with the pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto. And it currently has a market capitalization of 922 billion US dollars, which is almost half of the total value of cryptocurrencies. Bitcoin is not only the most popular cryptocurrency with the highest market capitalization, but it was also the first cryptocurrency to be created. The anonymous creator developed the digital coin as a way for people to send money over the internet. It was created to be used like regular money, but without the control that regular money has. Since the introduction of the first cryptocurrency in 2009, the general purpose of its creation has remained the same. More than 15,000 other cryptocurrencies have been created since then. Some of these other cryptocurrencies are Bitcoin clones, while others are built from the ground up to fulfill different purposes. Cryptocurrencies are not as widely used as a means of payment for goods and services as regular money. But the number of businesses and organizations accepting cryptocurrencies, especially Bitcoin, continues to grow. Ethereum, the second biggest cryptocurrency, now serves as a decentralized network for applications and smart contracts. A smart contract is a transaction protocol that is automatically executed once the terms of the agreement between buyer and seller are met. If you want to learn more about Ethereum and smart contracts, then subscribe to our channel and click the bell because we will be covering exactly that in our next videos. Cryptocurrencies are also served as a store of value that is generally untouched by banks and does not depend on a country's economy. This means that the value of the cryptocurrency you own is in no way dependent on your country's economy. The Bitcoin blockchain has been used by government officials to track and trace criminals because of its forensic analysis. However, there are some cryptocurrencies that are more privacy focused than Bitcoin and those transactions are nearly impossible to track. In addition, the crypto market is also very volatile. Since there is no central control, there is no one taking measures to control the market. This volatility is the reason why some people are concerned about the longevity of cryptocurrencies. Nevertheless, cryptocurrencies have been around for about 12 years and it doesn't look like they are going anywhere. And considering that cryptocurrency can be used as more than just a means of payment, you should give it a chance. But what do you think? Is crypto here to stay? Tell us more in the comment section. And while you're at it, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you know when we post a new video. We'll see you in the next one.